Hi YouTube community, I'm Lexi here. Welcome to Lexi's Weekly Lexicon. Today we're going to talk about how to organize your drawer better. I saw this on Pinterest and I thought I'd try it out. Okay, so if you can tell, my drawer is kind of full and I can't bring it out all the way. I can only take it out half light, but there's all down about this far deep. So if you can tell here, my clothes are kind of just thrown on top. I try to put the ones I don't use as much on the bottom, but then they never get used really. So. I found this method that you can kind of figure out how to see them all and better pick them out. Okay, so the first thing to do is to fold them in squares so that they're all even. So see this, you know, in that three part fold. And I also have these as the regular t-shirts in about the same but they're going to be a little bit bigger so I'm going to put them in a separate row. First I'm going to separate them into shirts that are more dressier to shirts that are just t-shirts. Okay let's get started then. Okay, so now I have them all separated. So now I'm going to put them up like this. That way I can see what they are. Okay, so now I have them all in a stack, all facing the right way. So now you're just going to go like this, and put them in that way. So that way it's kind of like you can see all they are. Add some more. So there we go, now you can see all the types of shirts that you have in your drawer and it kind of fits all in one place. The only thing is that I can't see the ones back here, so that makes it a little bit more difficult. So I was thinking I can maybe see them from the side though, so maybe I should flip them the side and then leave some space in between. Uh, on Pinterest they said that you can put kind of like a cardboard or some kind of splitter to keep it organized so that it doesn't go into the next one. But I think I'm going to just leave a space so that way I can see what's all the way in the back here. I'm going to start from back here and flip these shirts sideways. Actually, it gives me more room that way. Okay, so from this angle, you can see I have all these shirts upward facing, and these shirts are sideways back here. So there's a little bit more of a space, which is good because there's less space in the back. Now I'm going to try it with the other side. <laughs> now I've run into the dilemma where I can't see these sides because they take up a longer room. So 
so I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do. Okay, so now this is the final finished product. Uh, you can see all of the shirts are aligned, so I can see them all. I feel like while it helps if you have a full extended drawer, it works. I think I fit, it's just as stuffed as before, so I don't think it really saves much on room. I think it works if you have all like just regular t-shirts. In there, these are my smaller ones. They didn't work as well. They're kind of, they're not as tough, so they kind of like wrinkle down and fall. Um, I do have some room back here, which I just laid some shirts down. Um, but yeah, I feel like it's gonna be hard to pull out the shirt without like having them all kind of shift a lot. Uh, so I don't know, maybe I'll switch it back, uh, you know, in a week or so if I don't like it, but I mean, I, I get it. it. It seems like it would work if you could only view the ones all the way back there. That's the only problem I have noticed. Um, but yeah, I'll show you a closer look. So this is what it looks like right now. You can see the shirts that are kind of like tees work very well because you can see like what they actually are. The ones over here are kind of a little bit more difficult because there's not much on them so they're not really that distinguishable and they move a lot since they're of different fabrics. But all in all, it's a success, and I hope that this helped you figure out if you want to do the same to yours. And post in the comments if it worked, and if you liked it, or if you tried a different method. Uh, we'll see. Maybe I'll get back to you how it is in the comments. Flex out. Look. Oh, by the way. I did this before I realized I had a load of laundry left. So make sure that your laundry is always done before starting this so you know how much room you need to fit everything. Yeah. Lesson learned.